Hi, I'm Bill McPhee, CEO of Magpie Media Inc., your partner in mental wellness. Welcome to today's video blog. Today I want to talk a little bit about uh, a great movie that I really uh, enjoy and uh, you probably have maybe have seen it has to do with schizophrenia and that movie is uh, A Beautiful Mind and uh, the Beautiful Mind I use a lot of examples out of that uh, uh, movie uh, in my talk living with schizophrenia when I go across North America speaking and I just want to bring your attention to that movie and say that it's a great movie um, some of the things that I I talk about in that movie is uh, how John Nash's wife one of the scenes in the movie where um, she picks up a glass and uh, she whips it at the mirror in the bathroom and it all shatters and and uh, breaks to pieces and then she breaks down and, and starts crying. And one of the reasons that I think that is one of the greatest scenes in the in the movie is because that really shares and tells the story of what family members are going through while, when they are living with somebody with, with a mental illness and specifically schizophrenia. Uh, that was a great uh, uh, moment in that in that uh, movie as well as some classic symptoms where uh, positive symptoms where John Nash was basically in in a seclusion room and he was digging out his wrist he was paranoid and he thought that that uh, somebody put transistors in his wrist and they could uh, track him and do all kinds of things like that that of course was a delusion and part of his uh, delusion with his dealing with schizophrenia as well uh, part of the negative symptoms uh, in that movie a beautiful mind was when uh, John Nash's wife handed him the, the little infant, the little baby, and he's had it in his arms, and, and John couldn't coo it or comfort it or, or really, you know, comfort it. And that was a, a, a sign of negative symptoms or deficit symptoms. It was one of the symptoms that showed very prevalently what uh, negative symptoms are in schizophrenia. The reason I wanted to bring up A Beautiful Mind uh, is that I was reading in the uh, Pasadena Weekly where um, John Nash is going to be speaking. Um, John Nash is going to be speaking uh, at uh, the Fuller uh, Seminary School uh, in, in Pasadena. And uh, John's going to be talking about his, his experience with schizophrenia and, and, and his excitement about uh, at one time uh, being a Nobel Prize winner. And it was really exciting for uh, John and he accomplished it a lot. John got his PhD at uh, Princeton and, and his most uh, uh, the Nobel Prize is for uh, his work with game theory, uh, sort of nuclear war uh, game theory. So I just want to mention that, that uh, John's going to be speaking there. And uh, if you wanted to look up that article, just go to the Pasadena Weekly and you'll see uh, an article on John Nash. But uh, I just really was uh, privileged to read that and I love that movie. And if you haven't seen A Beautiful Mind, uh, go uh, and, and get it. So I'm sure it would be at the library uh, that you could find it and uh, play it. It was a great movie. So if you have a question for me uh, on my uh, daily video blog on recovery, just email me at bmcphee at magpiemags.com or go to our website mentalwellnesstoday.com. Thank you for tuning in and uh, we really want to be your partner in mental wellness. Have a great day.